Bernadine was um, this influential power broker, a mover, a shaker. His guy who pushed him, who made him the first president of what became, or the general secretary or something like that, um, of what became the USCCB was a man called Cardinal John Dearden of Detroit. Detroit. And so there's, there's, there's this wild connection there. Wild liberal. Yeah, wild liberal there. Great, great problem. But the, the gravest problem here is with the creation, I think, of the College of Bishops, the USCCB. What it does is, and Catholics today can't understand this because they've been inculcated in this notion uh, of, of the colleges of bishops, but in his own diocese, the bishop you is... Mean the, you mean the conferences uh, The bishops. conference of bishops, right, my apologies. Right. In the conference of bishops, the... Um, the, the bishop, he in his own diocese, he's pope. What he says is goes. But now there's this understanding of, well, the conference says da 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 da. We all voted on it, and the conference decided it wasn't my decision. We all voted on it, and that allows liberal bishops yeah. who don't want to be seen to be liberal, they get to skate.